Is your iPhone hurting your eyes? Do you have a headache? Do you have an eye strain? If yes, this video is for you. Let's start. Hello everyone, it's Miros. If you own an iPhone and you have a problems with your screen, it's hurting your eyes, you have a headache, then sorry, you are out of luck. You are like me and we are one of the few and we have a sensitive eyes to PWM which means pulse with modulation and this is came with AMOLED screens from iPhone 10 and above Apple are start using AMOLED screens in their phones and the problem is getting bigger with iPhone 12 because the screen is much brighter and that means it will hurt your eyes more and people with sensitive eyes like me and you who are watching this video will experience a headache, a sore eyes, eye strain and other problems which are caused by the screen of your iPhone. So let's try to fix that or at least make it better for our eyes. But before we start, if you are not already subscribed, please do this now and hit that bell icon so you never miss a video. Let's jump in. Alright guys, this is my iPhone 12 and of course I experience the same problems. I just had the feeling that this screen is burning my eyes and let's make it better. Let's decrease the brightness to zero point and probably now you can see on the cameras these black lines which are passing through our screen. That is the PWM or pulse width modulation and this always happens when the brightness is too low or the big issue is the backlight of our screen. Let's just increase the brightness and if you are at maximum brightness you can see these black lines are not here. So if you have a small issue and when you are lying in your bed at night you can leave the brightness slider in the middle and of course that will not hurt your eyes too much. And the other point is if you are like me and you have a very sensitive eyes and you have a headache and eye strain from this screen. Alright let's now try to fix that. We need to go in settings, display and brightness and here you can enable a dark mode on your iPhone. A dark mode is with less PWM because the backlight of your phone is not going directly in your eyes because AMOLED screens use a different technology and when there is a black part in the screen they are just stopping the light for it. That's how the AMOLED screens are working, so if you turn on dark mode, this will help a little bit, but we are not here for that. So until we are in settings and we already enable dark mode, let's go to accessibility, display and text size, scroll down a little bit and here you will find the option that we need, reduce white point. That's what we need guys, just enable it and you can see now what's the difference. The backlight is just going different. Now, of course, the screen is dimmer and we need to increase the brightness. Let's go it to maximum level and you can see how the screen is look like now. And because the screen brightness is going to the maximum level, that means PWM is not existing and it will not hurt our eyes. That's it guys, you can go to, if you are feeling well, you can go to 90% and if you are feeling better you can go to 60 or 50 i will go to 80 i'm okay at the 80 percent of reduced white point and this is how our screen will look like of course it's even better if you are going settings it's more darker everything is more darker without enable that option let's just disable it and you can see everything is more grayish but if we enable it it will go black and more darker and it's even more beautiful and the other point is if you are somewhere out at the sunlight and your screen is very dimmer and you can see a lot in it even with brightness slider to the maximum so it's not very comfortable every time to go in settings and disable reduce white point until you are somewhere out so let's just make a quick toggle in notification center to enable and disable this Let's go back, open settings, control center and here you need to add accessibility shortcut. Just tap the plus sign and now it's here. 
let's swipe it down and you can see we have an accessibility shortcut here if we tap it it will ask you open settings to enable accessibility shortcuts just tap here it will open settings and here you can just tap on reduce white point when it's enabled now we can go to our home screen we are out at sunlight just swipe down the control center and tap here reduce white point is disabled now and our screen is going to the full brightness when you are indoor and of course your screen is start hurting your eyes just swipe down for control center and tap here on accessibility shortcut enable reduce white point and now you will start feeling better and of course your eyes will thank you that was it guys if you like this video and if this video helps you don't forget to subscribe my channel and like my videos and if you want to make a video like this for android phones just leave a comment down below thanks for watching and have a nice day